What is up guys, Jerry and PZ. Welcome back to the channel. Also, the beautiful Christina K is gonna be joining us in this video um, because she actually surprised me with one of my dream cars. So what? What? down in the garage there's a Best 2019 in the world. Yeah, Mercedes AMG GTR. And uh, that's what we're gonna be rocking today. So sit back, relax, enjoy the video. All right, so this is the current garage situation. Look at this thing, guys. Like I said, 2019 Mercedes AMG GTR in the Green Hell Magna paint scheme. This is a $10,000 paint option. It's like five layer paint with a satin finish. It's absolutely incredible. And it also has the yellow calipers, the yellow stitching on the inside, and the yellow seat belts. So I was literally thinking about buying one of these and Christina knew it was like one of my favorite cars right now to date. So she picked one up for me and I've got this bad boy for the week. So originally she was gonna get this for me for my birthday, but the company that she was renting it from, um, the, someone who was renting it out actually had it totaled the day before we were supposed to pick it up or she was supposed to pick it up and she was gonna surprise me. Um, and then it all fell through. So she told me what happened and then I thought the car was done and I wasn't gonna be able to try it out. Turns out they got a new one. And then yesterday she, I came home and she surprised me with it. And I was so confused, it's hilarious. If you wanna check out that video, I'll link it in the description or you can just go to Christina's channel and check it out. So um, yeah, it's freaking gorgeous. Carbon fiber accents, the whole roof is carbon fiber. Actually, a lot of the bodywork is carbon fiber. It's just painted and carbon wing. You guys know how I love carbon fiber. So this is a V8 twin turbo, 577 horsepower going to the rear wheels, has all wheel steering. This is one of the fastest Nürburgring lap times of a rear wheel drive car and it's just an absolute savage. All right, gonna get some startups of the cars for you. They'll be cold start. I haven't heard anything cold yet, so I'm really curious to hear what she sounds like. Get a cold start of this bad boy our z06 corvette 650 horsepower we're gonna be giving this away actually this weekend so let's get a cold start of this bad boy oh my god this has an aftermarket exhaust so it's just like ridiculous okay we got to go to bun and chevrolet we're getting all new tires for this bad boy let's head on down guys this car is so freaking badass oh my god listen to it it pops every time you downshift. Oh my god, I love it. Teens is in front of us in the Z06. Oh man, we need to race these guys. I wonder which one's faster. <laughs> Just revving the car. <laughs> uh, let's see if I can give us a rev. Here we go. Hold on. Guys, this, people were driving up next to me on the highway, pulling their phones out to take pictures of this bad boy. There's my buddy Rupp pulling up in his uh, Chevy Colorado ZR2. He takes that thing off-roading, like literally everywhere. I will do an off-roading video with him, I promise. But right now, this is the bell of the ball. I'm obsessed with this car. I might have to buy one. For my birthday, I was actually thinking about flying to Texas, and they had one of these, the exact spec I wanted, and when we were gonna drive it back across the country home. But uh, yeah, this thing is a beast. What would you guys rather have? A car that could drive over top of this car? <laughs> or a car that could outdrive that car. Yeah. <laughs> Although if he's driving, it would be yeah. close. <laughs> I've seen this guy doing some crazy shit. Yeah, look at those 37s, baby. That's he's, dirty. He's like, hey, my truck's bigger than your truck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, arrived at Bunnin Chevrolet. Uh, hopefully our mid-engine Corvette will be here maybe later this week. Maybe next week. I think they shipped out. I think they officially shipped out. So we're dropping off the Corvette, the Z06. It's going to get four fresh tires. And then actually on Friday, we're getting the whole thing detailed. So whoever wins this bad boy, you are going to have a primed and ready car. We just had it tuned out at Full Throttle Customs at another 60 horsepower. It's probably about 700 horsepower to the crank right now. 
and it did uh, I think about like 640 to the wheel so this bad boy is juiced up and ready to go for its new owner uh, if, if you see this video before March 3rd you can still enter to win it uh, I'll put a link to Christina's patreon page in the description below so we're showing uh, Diego and my buddy Rupp the car and since we can't rev it in our neighborhood I can rev it for you guys people <laughs> I'm in heaven guys this thing is ridiculous it actually makes me really excited for the mid-engine Corvette too because I know that thing is gonna be great the handling on this is just like it is incredible oh, yes crap. don't make me sick Woo. oh god it's so absurd So took a little pit stop, stopped over at our gym. Our gym is Fitness 19. It's a dope ass new gym that just opened up. They got a big ass, um, what's this called? Turf area, all kinds of wind or equipment. And then it's kind of like a warehouse type deal. Rupp and I are gonna hit some legs. Jeremy and Christina are doing a push day. And then we're gonna get back out into the car, trip around some more, stay tuned. All right, workout's complete. Rupp and I did legs and back and shoulders for some reason. <laughs> yeah, and then Jeremy and Christina did what push day? Push, push day. Chest Jeremy's shoulders, just Mr. Shoulders over here, just walking around with a set of sh look. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Anywho, I'm gonna take Rupp for a ride in the uh, GTR first time. Let's get his reaction. All right, Rupp's first time in a Mercedes AMG GTR. Let's see if we can give a little pull here. This guy. Oh, oh my god, he's gonna be so big. Flat yes. like a horse. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, he's, he's so like a fluffy. freaking bear. Hi, oh, how old is he? Look at him. 13 weeks. Wow. What's his name? So big. Roshi. Roshi. Oh. <laughs> You're so floppy. Thank you. <laughs> so what kind of dog? Everything's is amazing. Golden retriever. Oh. Golden retriever. Golden retriever. Dude, his, his yeah. hair feels like Fur, like fluff, yeah, like yeah. It's like a big well, teddy bear. It's baby hair. He's gonna be big. He is gonna be so big. Cute. Look at him. He's like, no. You stop it. That's good. That's just, I like that. I've never seen that before. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. That dog is amazing. So, what did you think of the car? Oh my god. <laughs> this thing pulls. Right. So what we were talking about earlier, it feels like the Corvette, except that it's just rippier. It sucks to the ground. Yeah. I mean, it's amazing. Yeah, because the transmission's better. Puts the power down I better. Mean, the transmission, if yeah. you can feel night and day. it right when you shift, smack right into the next. Night and day. Year. How does it yeah. feel being a passenger compared to the Z06? Uh, is it similar? Yeah, no, it's similar, but uh, I feel like um, everything is just like you can almost feel it gripping to the ground. It wants I'm, to. I'm not even in control. Exactly. Of driving yes, that's what I said. I can feel it just 
hold on to yeah. the ground better. The grip that it has is so freaking crazy, dude. Yeah, even like going over a speed bump, I can feel hitting the front, driving up over it, coming back down the backside. Like you can feel all of it, you know? Because it just, it's just like, get me on the ground, get me on the ground. It's a track car. That's basically what yeah, it is. Amazing. It's a bona fide track car. Things unreal. Yeah, it's yeah. sick. Hell yeah. It looks so small sitting next to your truck. <laughs> your truck's like, I might eat you later. <laughs> like this is higher than the, than the hood. It is. It literally is. The tire is bigger than the hood. That's hilarious. I love it. Yeah. All right, so check this out, guys. I actually got a gaming PC set up, uh, and I also use it for like my workstation, my editing. I have my PlayStation set up. My uh, laptop, oh, my laptop's not in there. But anyway, I use my laptop so I can all run it off of this. Uh, I'm playing some WoW right now. But anyway, the whole point of all of this is uh, we're getting teens a streaming setup. So she's gonna start streaming on Twitch. I'll actually put her, what's your, is it Khalil19? Yeah. Khalil19 on Twitch, if you want to check out teens. We've been streaming Apex on our Playstations, but now we want to get a little bit more intense. So, uh, yeah, this is just an iBuy Power. It was a pre-built uh, setup. It's really nice. If you guys want to see, like, a whole gaming desktop setup and all that, uh, let me know in the comment section below. But um, I'm going to practice streaming on mine and see how it runs everything. And if it all works, we're going to get teens the same setup. But right now, I actually am going to run down to Alex, her little brother's school, and pick him up in the AMG GTR <laughs> and see if we can get some reactions out of people. So, uh, stay tuned. All right, so I just pulled up to uh, San Marcos, waiting to pick up Alex, teen's little brother from school, see his reaction to the GTR. There he is. I can hear that thing. <laughs> you can, yeah, you can throw your bag in there. Don't use the. They said don't use the. Uh, don't use the uh, carbon fiber spoiler. What do you think of this bad boy? You dig it? It stands out a little bit, huh? <laughs> Doesn't it sound so good? Like. <laughs> Out so much, I was literally my class. I could see this car peeking through the halls of all the people. I see all like the cars. A, I see this little fan of green. I'm like, what is that? And then I see this guy revving over here. The my from green hell. It's just popping over here. It's so, it's so funny. Dude, on the highway today, we took the Corvette down. People were pulling up next to us, pulling out the phone and, and filming our cars. It's a dope car. Yeah. It's like also I feel like it's not like as douchebaggy. You know what I mean? Cause yeah, cause it's like it's like it's elegant. elegant. It's elegant. You know, like if you did with a Lambo, it'd be my. Oh god. Guys, it was funny. I was like trying to figure out like the climate control and I like hit this button and I was like, uh, what the fuck is this? I was like, you know what? I'll just leave it wherever it is. <laughs> it's so freaking ridiculous, dude. Oh, man. I love it, man. This thing is so cool. Look at that dashboard. It's oh, so it's badass. So cool. It's wow. sick, dude. And man, it does it get looks. It's crazy. I actually like the dash so a lot. Like it's better I than I be, thought. I thought it'd be really worse because the yellow number system. Yeah, like, no, it looks it sick. Seems a lot better. Dude, you should see it at night too when it's all lit up. It looks so cool. <laughs> Alright, so what do you think of this, Alex? This is by far my favorite car. Yeah? I got good I got good taste, right? This is it looks brilliant. It does. Like, it really looked good in, in person. Photos, and then in person, it's like 10 times better. Oh, God. It's so much better. And it's fast. It yes. sounds amazing. Really, the grip. Like, the grip. I don't know. I think maybe my only problem is like. I can't think of really one. Just maybe it goes through a lot of gas. But that's pretty typical. <laughs> it's a V8. It's a V8. Twin turbo. The is. Twin turbo V8. Yeah, because Alex was. We were going back and forth on like what car would be good for my channel, and this is the one that I really liked. What were you trying to tell me to get? Uh, the, I was saying the RE. There's something else. Oh, the Porsche, the Porsche, the new Porsche. The new Porsche 911. But like this is so much cooler. It's cooler. Yeah. But it's also um, rare. You can't. It's rare too. But I'm yeah. just saying, like, if you're to buy it, there's not really a lot of mods you can do to it. It's, it's already. It's I mean, so I, I mean, I would get different wheels on this, different rims. Uh, I would do a full exhaust on it. I would do a tune, maybe bigger turbos. I mean, there's a lot of stuff. Eventually, I'd wrap it a different color just to, for shits. But yeah, you're right. It is like almost a done car. Yeah. That's the that's sure. the problem. For also, sure. I think about these. Uh, what are they called? These white little strips 
on the rims and the wheels. Yeah, but I don't know what they are. They are a little dirty. That's my only. <laughs> That's just the car. I guess we'll you're take it dirty easy. We'll take it to the car wash. But it is. I love this spec. It's so beautiful. So yeah, you just feel like James Bond, and it's like it's showy because of the green, but it's also like it's not showy because it's a Mercedes, you know. So it's like I don't know. I'm surprised how much attention it gets. It gets a lot of attention. I'm very it's surprised. Like, remember last time we brought the R8 to school last year? I think one kid yelled "asshole" because <laughs> you just look like a show off, you look right? Like a show off the kept revving it. Yeah. This no. It's more like holy shit! It's, it's James it's like, Bond. Whoa. This yeah, right it's here. badass. All right, we're going over to Imperial Barber Shop. It's my local barber hook up with Gordy. Let's get Alex a fade. Yeah. There you go. The nice clean fade from Gordy. If you guys are in Santa Barbara, your local Imperial bar Barber Shop, hit up Gordy. I'll put it in the description as well. He's the one that gives me all my clean fades. <laughs> so letting Gordy check out the car. There's a red, look, see how it's the only oh, button okay, that's lit okay. up? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, please, like, what am I looking please for? press me. And then oh, turn that dial, put it in Sport Plus. Or race, either one. See how it opens up? Now give us some gas. Rev that bitch. <laughs> this is, is awesome. This is so ridiculous. It pops so much. It's incredible. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that nasty? I'll have to take you for a ride maybe. I have it all week, so. <laughs> I know. <laughs> There's nothing nasty. Dude, it has four wheel steering. So even the rear tire steer. No way. Yeah, it's nasty, dude. It's such a fun car. Check this out, guys. So Alex, finally, I was trying to figure out how to get into the menu settings and all this. Look at all this stuff. It does like a simulation of it. So it's like automatic <laughs> folding mirrors. It'll show you folding it on the screen. That is does. so freaking sick. Locator lighting and it moves around like, oh, wow. And look, oh. it has AMG it puts down on the side from the That's mirrors. That's what it's yeah. Automatic locking and you have like easy open walking to it. Wow, this, this is, is awesome. This is really I am such okay, a dork. Like I'm such a nerd for this kind of shit. Real wow, question. That is so cool. Let's take it, back. it is kind of hard. It's kind of not intuitive though, right? Yeah, you gotta get used to it. Yeah. Let's flex on some fools. <laughs> oh my god, it never gets old. The downshifts. Oh my god. That is incredible. This thing is a race car. Engine data. I know, it is a race car. <laughs> it's a freaking race car for this. the street. Is it our vehicle? Damn, car? look at this. What goes on? Oh, we can see our G-Force. Whoa, that is... Dude, leave this shit up. Yeah, that's how you gotta drive around. I hope they can see this on the screen. It's really dark. Oh, man, it sucks. That is freaking badass. Because this thing pulls some serious Gs. You can feel it. The grip's freaking insane. Oh, I know what this is, I think. So oh, dude, it even is, shows the braking brake and throttle. And then this is your throttle. Oh, See God. that over there? Look, so this is my braking. Wow, this that is, is sick. I'm leaving that on right yeah, there. Yeah, let's just leave. We can see how much camp puts on. <laughs> now you can see how crazy I am. <laughs> that is hilarious. <laughs> oh, God. So check this out, Cam's driving right now. <laughs> you could literally see what's going on in the engine. So that you can see crazy. the amount of horsepower, the amount of foot pounds of torque, the and then the speed. Look, it even has engine temperature. It has the think. engine temperature, it is an awesome wow. car. This is cool. It's absurd. Is there other stuff in there too, or is it just this Let's one? Let's see. Let's go back. Engine data. Oh yeah, you can easily see it through here. Individual, that's, so that's if you want to change all the yeah. different settings and suspension and all this that. This is what we're really excited for, is the vehicle data, because then you can just see that's, his brake that's sick. and his throttle percent, and then that's your Gs. That's so freaking so cool, dope. man. Wow. This is awesome. Once you like get used to doing all this, it, it becomes really cool. It is a little cumbersome to use all this. Yeah, look at all this. It's like, it's, it's, it's not intuitive. In case you're wondering, this is all done with the scroll wheel, and then the back button is over here for some reason. Yeah, like it's just, oh, there's so a back weird. button up here too. Oh, okay, cool. Dope. So I guess you can go back like that. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then you can go through individual configuration. Man, this is so cool. Engine data, I like that. I think you my press favorite. down to select. Yeah. Are there others? Oh, it's just this. It's just this. Okay, gotcha. I think my favorite part is when they show the car. Look. How can we just went up to 240 horsepower? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. This is so dope. So check this out, guys. I found a bunch of different settings. You can put like navigation and stuff up there, all kinds of different things. You can even show similar screens to what you have over here. And then I just realized this has taptic feedback built into the steering wheel. So it has lane assist. So if you start to go out of the lanes, um, it'll vibrate on the side of the lane that you're about to exit or go out of. It just gives you like some taptic feedback to be like, hey, watch it, watch out, you're about to go out of the lane. It's just, 
This, this car has a lot of technology. I'm really impressed by it. All right, so uh, me and the lady are gonna take this bad boy out. I have to run down for a chiropractor appointment, and then we're gonna go to happy hour and also take some day. photos. Oh, yeah, and look so at this hot. outfit. Hot Miami Styles with the oh, heels. Yeah. Crushing it. Actually, the sun's probably <laughs> making that ruined. Crushing there we it. go, look at that. We'll do a little twirl, let's see, let's see the backside. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Subscribe for that, guys, and thumbs up the video. <laughs> let's go. All right, just finished at Weston Chiropractic. Absolutely love this place. They have fixed teens and eyes backs so much. If you're local in Santa Barbara and you need back work done, highly recommend him. And he's also a doctor as well, Dr. Weston. Amazing. Walking out to this thing is just absolutely ridiculous. And actually, um, um, one of the uh, one of the workers. What's her What's her name? His daughter. Heather, I think it's Heather, yeah. Heather, her, Heather's husband, this is his dream car, so she's gonna come out and take a photo and send it to him. <laughs> Look at this thing, oh my God. And then we're gonna drive over to Hope Ranch and take some photos, and I think we're gonna go to Boathouse and sit by the water and have a drink. All right, so we arrived at the Hope Ranch Overlook. This is where we take a lot of our photos for Instagram. There's a golf course with a lake in the background. It looks absolutely amazing. By the way, if you're not following us on Instagram, you totally should. I'll put Teens and myself uh, Instagram on the on the uh, screen right here, and they're always in the in the description as well. So the beast from the green hell. I know. I was sorry. Isn't this the, isn't this thing incredible though? It is. You look so good. You look so good next to it. All right, let's take some photos. All right, just got a call that the Corvette is ready for fresh tires, and we figured, you know what? Let's just take both cars down to the beach. Because why not? <laughs> because why not? Let's start this bad boy up. Oh my oh, yeah. God. AMG, you have my heart. It sounds <laughs> so good. Listen to it, boys. Here comes the beast, freshly washed, four new tires. Thank you, Bunnin at Chevrolet. Also, if you're watching this video on on Thursday, you can still enter to win this today, uh, March 3rd. Entries are closed after that. This Saturday, March 7th at 1 p.m., we will be choosing the winner for this car. And look at those fresh tires. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go to the boathouse and get some drinks, babe. What do you think? Yes. I'm updating the Patriots, yes, that. there's new tires. <laughs> I love it. Got the Corvette in front of me in blue, and then the Beast from Green Hell in green. Oh, dude. I'm gonna miss both of these cars because neither of them are ours. <laughs> At least we have the mid-engine coming soon. Dude, teens, you look so badass in that thing. <laughs> now I have two sports cars. When we were revving it. <laughs> oh, Louise loved it. Yeah, that was awesome. He was hanging out of his car film in it <laughs> oh god i feel like we should always be able to just park right in the front, right in the front yeah. yeah like nope just give these to us please anyway we're at boathouse i'll show you what it looks like in a second this is california in the beginning of march just absolutely stunning it boathouse it, it is a little chilly even right now but oh man it is beautiful all right so we got a seat right by the fire which is amazing because it's a little chilly out here um christina started off with the fish and chips fish and chips and we also ordered some chips and guac chips and guac with some pico de gallo pico de gallo and then i got okay 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 and then i got a bowl of clam chowder and a 
What is this? Margarita. A margarita. A, uh, orange, orange. Orange. Blood orange, blood orange margarita. Orange. Thank you. I know this. So, one. yeah, that's gonna do it. Excited. All right, just finished dinner. I'm nice and full. Stuffed. Yeah, nice and stuffed. Um, and I think that's gonna do it for this video. So, I hope you guys. Yeah, it's just absolutely <laughs> stunning out here. Look at this. God, it's ridiculous. So. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I've been loving this car. I have it until Sunday. Shout out to, uh, what is it? What's the company? Well, no, shout out to Eric and Brett from Turo. Yeah, follow them on Instagram, Drive Los Angeles. Yeah, and I'll, I'll link their uh, information in the description below if you're interested in renting a car from them. They have all kinds of crazy exotics. They have some of the best prices around. They're super cool people. And um, now Tara wants to buy one. Now I kind of want to buy Great. a DTR. Whoops. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna wait for the Corvette. Uh, we'll get that. We'll have some fun with that, and then uh, we'll go from there. If you guys think I should buy an AMG GTR, leave a comment in the comment section below. Uh, thank you so much, teens, uh -huh. for the car. Really appreciate it. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.